Well guys, the summer season is finally upon us. And you know what that means. That's right, we have new summer seasonal flavors of Van Luen ice cream. Now for this seasonal collection, we have a total of eight different flavors, which means my blood sugar is about to skyrocket. Now those eight flavors include Key Lime Pie, Summer Peach Crisp, Kiwi Burst, Hot Honey, Tiramisu, Campfire S'mores, and of course with every Van Leeuwen seasonal release we have a weird flavor, and this time it's Arizona Green Tea. Now all of these flavors sound fantastic and I'm so excited to try them. And despite the fact that it's summertime, it's currently really cloudy and rainy, which means this is the perfect weather to eat some ice cream. So let's do it! Okay, uh, I'm not sure what flavor to start with. Well, I know I want to save the weird flavor for last, so I'm going to put the Arizona green tea to the side for now. Alright, I'm going to blindly pick from the rest of the group, um, this one. Looks like the first flavor I'm trying is hot honey. And nothing makes us happier than this hot honey ice cream. If you've never drizzled hot honey onto your ice cream, raise your hand. No? Really? It's a combination you might not think of until you try it, and then think, how have I never tried this before? It's like that. So we've made things easy for you. No honey jar required. Alright, Van Leeuwen's Hot Honey Flavored Ice Cream. Let's go. Holy crap, this is delicious. The bits of honey in this ice cream are so good. However, I wouldn't say that it's hot. There is a little bit of a kick, but it's very minor. But overall, this is delicious, and if you like hot honey, then I would definitely recommend this. Alright, well seeing as the blind picking went so well the first time, I think I'm gonna keep doing it. Alright, this one. Campfire S'mores. And nothing makes us happier than this Campfire S'mores ice cream. It's got toasted marshmallow ice cream. It's got toasted chocolate fudge swirls. It's got loads of graham cookies and marshmallows. No campfire needed, so there's more time for s'more scoops. I see what you did there. Alright, Van Leeuwen Campfire S'mores ice cream. Let's go. Oh man, this is fantastic. I love the fact that the ice cream itself is marshmallow flavored, and yet they still put bits of actual marshmallow in it. But yeah, the marshmallow flavored ice cream is delicious, the fudge swirls are delicious, and the graham cookies and the marshmallows add a really good bit of texture as well. So yeah, needless to say, if you like s'mores, then you should try this. Next up we have... Summer Peach Crisp! And nothing makes us happier than this Summer Peach Crisp ice cream. Picture this if you will. A hot summer day, the sun is shining, you're sweating, ew. Someone hands you a scoop of ice cream with peaches and a gluten-free oat crumble. Clutch move. Alright, Van Leeuwen's Summer Peach Crisp flavored ice cream. Let's go! This is very good. I will say though, it took me quite a few bites in order to reach the peach flavor, but once you hit that flavor, it is very good. And I also really like the addition of the oat crumbles. They add a nice touch. And of course, whenever I start eating the summer peach crisp flavor, the sun comes out from the rain. But yeah, if you like peaches, you're gonna like this ice cream. Next up we have... Tiramisu. And nothing makes us happier than this tiramisu ice cream, because we couldn't decide between two good things coffee and vanilla ice cream. So we chose both, but then we didn't stop there, so we added chocolate chips, but then we also threw in some cake pieces, and suddenly we had tiramisu ice cream. Now here's the thing, I don't really care for coffee, so of all the flavors this is probably going to be my least favorite. However, the added bits of the cake pieces and the chocolate chips just might save it for me. Alright, Van Leeuwen's tiramisu flavored ice cream, let's go. It's fine. I'll be honest, I initially almost gave up on this flavor because the very first bite was nothing but just coffee flavor. But I powered through it and I ate a few more bites until I managed to get everything in one scoop. And at that point, again, it's fine, but I wouldn't go back for this. If you like tiramisu or you like coffee, then you'll probably enjoy this more than I do, but for me, I'm not gonna go back for this. Alright, next up we have banana cream pie. And nothing makes us happier than this banana cream pie ice cream with fudge swirls. It's got banana ice cream, pie crust pieces, and swirls of fudge. It's got all you need for the yummiest of spoonfuls. Alright, Van Leeuwen's banana cream pie flavored ice cream. Let's go! This is pretty good! The ice cream actually has a very strong banana flavor, but the fudge swirls keep it from being too strong. 
And then of course you have the added pie crust pieces for the additional texture. So yeah, I would definitely recommend this. All right, let's see what we got next. Key lime pie. And nothing makes us happier than this key lime pie ice cream because it reminds us of vacation, and vacation is good. Good like key lime ice cream made even gooder with pieces of graham cracker crust. Please excuse us while we put up our ooh message. Sunny's on. All right, Van Leeuwen's key lime pie flavored ice cream. Let's go. Holy crap, this is freaking amazing. Up until now, the hot honey was my favorite flavor that I've tried so far, but now it's definitely key lime pie. This has a very strong but very good lime flavor to it. And while this is an extremely tart lime flavor, there is a bit of creaminess to it, which keeps it from being overtly tart. But yeah, if you're a fan of key lime pie, I would definitely recommend this. So now that leaves us with our last normal flavor, Kiwi Burst. And nothing makes us happier than this Kiwi Burst ice cream. Because summer is hot and you need something refreshing. Refreshing like jumping into a pool after a hot day. Like that. So that's what this is. The ice cream version of a refreshing pool dip. Sweet cream ice cream with swirls of kiwi. Alright. Van Leeuwen's Kiwi Burst flavored ice cream. Let's go. This is pretty good. Honestly, there's really not much to say here. It has a good kiwi flavor mixed with a vanilla ice cream. If you like kiwi, then you'll probably like this. And now we have our weird flavor for the season. Arizona green tea. And nothing makes us happier than this Arizona green tea ice cream. Only the greatest things hail from Brooklyn, New York. Like Arizona. And yours truly. And the best style of pizza. And the Dodgers. So we had to join forces with the iconic drink brand and create an iconic ice cream with green tea and ginseng and honeycomb candy. Now, I know that this is a green tea flavor, so it's going to look green, but this looks sickly green. It's not a very appetizing look. <laughs> All right, Van Leeuwen's Arizona green tea flavored ice cream. Let's go. I'm not sure how to feel about this flavor. <laughs> now, I should start off by saying that I've never actually had Arizona green tea before because I can never find their diet version anywhere, but I've had Lipton's diet green tea before and I really liked it. And this definitely has a very good green tea flavor. I also really like the little bits of the honeycomb candy as well. But then there's an aftertaste that kicks in that I do not like at all. And I'm assuming that might be coming from the ginseng, but I can't really tell. So while initially this tastes good, the more you let it sit in your mouth, it just gets bad. So this might be the first weird Van Leeuwen flavor that I don't recommend. <laughs> But now let's rank these bad boys. Number one is definitely going to be the key lime pie flavor. This was fantastic, and I'm definitely going to finish this by the end of the week. And then a very close second goes to hot honey. Number three would be campfire s'mores, kiwi burst for number four, summer peach crisp for number five, banana cream pie at number six, and then surprisingly, tiramisu is gonna be at number seven because I thought for sure this would be my least favorite. But no, that goes to Arizona green tea. And would you look at that? It's starting to rain again. But let me know what you guys thought. Were you guys curious to try these for yourselves? Or if you've had them, let me know what your favorite flavor was and what your least favorite flavor was in the comments down below. And while you're down there, I will also have a link for all my social media channels as well as a contribution link in case you guys want to help support the channel. If you guys enjoyed the video, then make sure to like it and subscribe as well because I have more content just like this coming soon. But yeah, that'll do it for this review. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.